Well, my story starts way back. Remember scouting? Did you know Baden Powell visited Oshawa? Mm -hmm. Did you know that this area we're in right now was a historic trail running from Lake Ontario into the interior and back? The stone there on the table is a foundation stone from a house next door, one of the early pioneers. Uh, people through prehistory may have passed this land. I did some research. I probably can't see this too well, but this is the prophet. He's a native Indian, uh, First Nation, from the United States. Uh, it's maybe a representation of him. Uh, he was uh, killed in battle. His brother, you might have heard of, was Tecumseh. Mm -hmm. Tecumseh saved Canada during the War of 1812, the Native Participation. Tecumseh was killed in battle. Here's where it gets a little bit more interesting. Tecumseh was replaced by his second in command, Oshawanahan. Mm -hmm. Notice the name, Oshawanahan. Mm -hmm. After the war, Oshawanahan was noted to travel around. Um, this trail from the lake up to the Scugog and all that which no, could have been a path he was traveled on. Scouts may have traveled on it. We've got a direct connection to a prophet. Tecumseh was never, uh, we never found where he's buried. Never know I sell real estate. I'm connected with the land. I also sell metal detectors. You almost wonder, is there any hidden treasures around? Uh, what could have been buried? Let's just step back. Oshawa. The water bottle here. The paths along the creek. And all that. The story is a bunch of white men were in a um, meeting in downtown Oshawa, it, what's now downtown Oshawa, and talking, what do we call our city? Our city, our white city. The Schwa. The schwa. No, they decided <laughs> to call, uh, the story was some natives, First Nation people, were um, walked through the meeting. And the story is told down is that they said, call it Oshawa. It's the place where the canoe is tr changed for the trail. Right. Remember about that Indian guy? <laughs> Oshawanahan. I know I would have a sense of humor if I were there as a native. What would we call our land? Our land, it, it wasn't our land as a white man. It was a native land. Could you see them with a sense of humor saying, call it Oshawa after our leader. Uh, our leader may have passed through this area. Could he have ever left anything in this area? You know, you know the prophet? This is where you get into the, the fun stuff. Did they ever bury rocks? This is nickel. Nickel. Yes. You get interesting things there. We, we presume that the natives were never mystic. I'm sure they liked crystals too. Let's see what else we can find in here. Imagine. Ooh. Yeah. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. What is it the scouts used to say? Wood, water, fire, and tree. Wisdom, strength, and courtesy. See? I think Osh was well suited. Maybe we've got some hidden treasures. Some wisdom, some strength, courtesy, all that.
you know, sure, there's bad too. Uh, even the dark, though, if you shine the light on it, right way, mm. can shine nice. Smoky quartz. I love smoky quartz. Yeah, oh. and that's a big cut of it too. The real thing is, is good. We've all got these hidden vessels. We think of the, the wars in the past. There's the obsidian. Mm -hmm. Looks different when it's high a nice crystal. There's a copper. Is it all story? Probably. But it doesn't have to be. Wow, very interesting. Wow. I feel like I should clap. We could finish it off with our favorite Kumbaya. 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 Kumbaya.